Hello, this is Calvary Episcopal Church's noonday prayer service. My name is John Smith, and I'm joined by Mary J. Reniker. Uh, thank you for joining us today. And if you'd like to follow along on the screen, we have the order of service for noonday. This is taken from the Book of Common Prayer. So let us begin with just a moment of silence. O oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. We'll now read Psalm 119 in unison. Your word is a lantern to my feet, and a light upon my path. I have sworn and am determined to keep your righteous judgments. I am deeply troubled. Preserve my life, O Lord, according to your word. Accept, O Lord, the willing tribute of my lips, and teach me your judgments. My life is always in my hand, yet I do not forget your law. The wicked have set a trap for me, but I have not strayed from your commandments. Your decrees are my inheritance forever. Truly, they are the joy of my heart. I have applied my heart to fulfill your statutes forever and to the end. And we say together, glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. The love of God has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit that has been given to us. Thanks be to God. Now we begin the prayers. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Please join me in saying the contemporary version of the Lord's Prayer found on the right side of the screen. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer. And let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, send your Holy Spirit into our hearts to direct and rule us according to your will, to comfort us in all our afflictions, to defend us from all error, and to lead us into all truth. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Now I invite you to take a moment and offer up any concerns that are on your heart or offer up anything you'd like to give thanks for. And we conclude by saying, let us bless the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Thank you for joining us. Have a good rest of your day.